I'm Andy Mitten and I'm walking down the Caledonian Road in North London, walking away from Arsenal Stadium, the Emirates, where Arsenal have just defeated Manchester United 3-1 to continue their very impressive start to the Premier League season. If you're asking me as a journalist, I will praise Mikel Arteta's side because they're very good and we saw that last season. If you're asking me as a fan, I feel incredibly disappointed because I was in the away end today and... Well, just before the end, I thought Manchester United had got the winning goal, but it was ruled offside. So, as Arsenal fans walk all around me now, their disposition is very different to mine. United have had an uneasy start to this season. It was the same last season. Two wins and two defeats from the opening four games. The away form at good teams continues to be really poor for Manchester United. Rasmus Hoyland, the young striker, came on and made his debut in a Manchester United shirt but the feeling as I left that away end was one of huge disappointment some encouragement that the team were actually not as bad as some feared because United's record at Arsenal in recent years is absolutely terrible it's defeat after defeat after defeat and that's not good enough so now unfortunately there's an international break so there's no club football now for a couple of weeks so the mood will fester somewhat among Manchester United fans Arsenal fans, well, they're delirious. They're absolutely delighted to beat Manchester United once again. And I can't blame them. But with five minutes of the game to go, it seemed like it was going to be a draw. And just before that, it seemed like Manchester United were going to get a win. I'm going to continue my long walk back to Euston Station, clear my head and get a train back to Manchester. Good night.